Welcome to Crazy Toys. Today we have this Barbie and the Rockers drummer. And this is the only one from the Barbie and the Rockers that I probably would have picked up besides the little girls. Um, because I just like this one because she just has so much more style and she looks like she might could play some drums. I don't know. I'm just going to say that. She looks, she has a cute style and I think her head is turn wrong. I do not know how that happened. Before we get started, if you have not clicked that subscribe button, be sure to click that subscribe button now and click that little bell so you'll be notified of future videos. all out of the box with her drums. So there she is holding the drumsticks. Um, she's, she's a really cool girl. Loving the pink and the, oh, is that brown or tan? I guess that's like a tan. And it feels all foofy, foofy. It doesn't like feel like there's a lot of, it doesn't feel like there's a lot of product in it. She does have an issue right there. But I don't, it doesn't feel like any product. It's just a poof. And it's really cool. I mean, she even has a different stripe back here. It goes in like that. Really, really, really cool. It just looks like like she just went around and decided to buy that part of her head pink. So it looks really cool. Um, I love her shirt. I love the big swoopiness of it because you can kind of like because I think it looks. I like it. Really looks cool off the shoulder like that. She looks super cool like that. Um, um, she has two different boots. I think it's cool. Really, really cool. <laughs> um, I like these pants. These shiny pants. Really cool. Um, she does not have a made, a fully made to move body. She just, she like bends at the waist, the legs, and then her knees bend. Her, her feet do not have any kind of movement. That's what makes her, you know, well, of course, there's a lot more to a fully made boot body. But she does bend at the elbow. Glad she did, because that would have been like a disaster. Her lip. Oh, okay, I thought her lip was her salt. Oh, that was just hair. <laughs> her hair. And, um. Yeah. I, I just. I don't know what kept them from making her a made to move. I really could not tell you, um, but it would have been like a disaster if her arms didn't move. Um, but there was Barbie and the, the original Barbie and the Rockers. I don't think the drummer or any of them had movable arms like this, so that was probably like a issue if you wanted your doll look like it was really playing drums, you know, because she's got all these movements where it can look like she's really gonna play drums, and it's like one, two, three, four, or something, you know. She can do that, so that's really great. Um, so she, she was, like I said, she was my favorite from the Barbie and the Rockers group, and I and we got and when I seen these, I was like, where is she gonna wear those? But I guess, but I think I did see where she could wear them around her uh, neck. No, I don't think it's working. <laughs> so yeah, they're not really of use for her ears. I think her face is really cute. Um, does anybody know what mold this is? I would say like a lot. I would say like a Nikki. Is it? Um, comment below if you know who this face mold is. Um, and then we're gonna sit her here on her drum, on her stool, her drum stool, and we're having issues. Already we have issues with the. The, the ink was not bending, but just put her drum in front of her. And she looks right back in. It's like, if you look, her she doesn't, her body doesn't do just right for the drum. Unfortunately. Yeah, this, this, the stool? Is a little off. Is a little off for her. 
I think possibly it should have been a little bit taller. <laughs> no, let me see these. Yeah, in that picture they totally have her knees bent. And that is not how a drummer does. Like I think they don't I think they totally just bent her bent her knee like this and then pushed the drum in. That's literally all they did. <laughs> just to get a good picture. Um so I just think a little bit the stool could have been higher or taller, I'm not sure. Probably higher. Yeah, that covers her face. We don't wanna cover her face. Um But yeah. So here she is. Um Um one of my favorite things about her. I love her outfit, I love her hair, and I love how this top can be kind of like an off the shoulder kind of thing if you want it to be. You can like tuck it back. I think it was a little large for her maybe because it's like really had a lot of movement but I like the off the shoulder thing. Um, I love these pants. I love these shiny tight leggings. Super super cool. Um, I know she's a drummer, but I really don't know why she come with these headphones. She really can't wear them. She can just kind of like hang them around her neck. I guess she's supposed to be cool like that. I don't, I guess that's supposed to be cool like that, I guess. I don't know. Because right here it shows you where her headphones are. So, yeah, maybe a different accessory besides than the headphones. Um, and some people might not like that she comes with two different some people might not like that she comes with two different color shoes but I kind of like it think it's cool um, because she has two different um, two different color they're the same color as the drumsticks so I think that's cool um, the drums let's look at the drums it's kind of cool because this little thing goes ding ding little twits around it doesn't go ding ding but it twits around like here it looks like it's got the little foot thing for your drum and they're, I love that they're translucent really cool um, they say it says Barbie and the Rockers I really like her I'm glad to have picked her up um, I um, in case you're wondering I picked her up at the flea market for five dollars so she was a good little flea market grab even though I don't hardly ever find very many dolls at my flea market um, she was a good grab market so I was so happy to get her um, you comment below what your favorite thing was about her and if you have her comment below if you've like changed her into a different outfit or if she's not even a Barbie rocker at all is she on a made-to-move body now comment below and let me know I'd like to know and cuz well, everybody knows I don't really I don't really buy made the moves and then a Barbie to switch out because make the moves are expensive you're gonna pay $15 for a made to move. Then you're gonna pay $10 for another doll just because you want her head on a made to move. I it it just doesn't sound like a great deal to me because that's like $25 that you then pay for a doll, and then the other body you don't even want it. You know it's kind of silly. Well, I guess if you wanted them, you could put the head back on the made to move and donate it. Because obviously you don't want the body. So, yeah, it's just a little crazy that. Um, but I do love her. Alright, so um, thanks for joining us here at Crazy Toys, guys. I hope you enjoyed this doll unboxing. And I hope you'll click that subscribe button and click that little bell so you won't miss another video just like this. So, yay, thanks for joining us, crazy peeps. Bye!